Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Chell's Trouble 2 by RoboSK. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Without further ado, let's jump into the description. Another addition to the on-off series. So another one, like yesterday, like the last two days. Uh, difficulty medium. Chell has a problem again. Please help her solve this problem. Don't need the dirt unsolved. Places by Jake Courtney, Toby, and Cactus consulted Toby on the puzzle as well. Without further ado, let's jump in, shall we? Alrighty then. Laser collision is off. Good to note. Uh, let's fly into the channel. What am I walking for? I'm going to walk. Okay, so we have a funnel telling us to go there first. We need a cube and a laser, it seems. Could I not just, like, jump down here? What does this button do? What does this one do? Hopefully it's a return path. I do believe it is. Good stuff. Good stuff indeed. It's a bit... Weird. Z fighting. Uh, anyway, let's go into number one, shall we? And see what we can see what we can see. Guessing that's a way for us to get back. Okay. We got through here. Something I probably should have pressed before I came through here. Woo! Thank you. So I'll take this cube. And... So where is that funnel exactly? Yeah, that one there. Where is that funnel? That's a good question. It's a very good question. So we're gonna need that button to We're gonna need that one to be able to go up there ultimately, which I guess is gonna disable the fizzler so we can get that and take it down to the exit. So maybe we'll try and um, just down here. Looks like this is going to do something else. So yeah, it does something in that direction, so let's um, head on over there, shall we? To infinity! And beyond! Alright. So let's head to number two. Ooh, interesting. That turns that off as well. Interesting. So a timer. A very short timer. So I guess we can. It's allowing us to. What? You for real? So that. I'll... What? I have no idea what's going on there. Um. Okay. So. What if we hadn't have done that? Uh, I I can, can I take that back? I don't know if I can take the cube back or not now. Well, I ain't gonna cube back now, am I? Alright, let's save a bit of time. Look over here. La la la. Up to here. La la la. And... Now we need to get the cube again. Boom de boom. Okay. Alright, so now we'll fire this over here. 
That gives a permanent portal gun for the time being. Which is fantastic. Up the funnel we go again. Oh crap. I should have put a portal there to get around. <sighs> Alright, well. I honestly thought the dissolving area. Ready? I thought the dissolving area was only for um Oh wow. I thought the dissolving area was only for portals. I didn't realise it actually dissolved the cube. Just, what's going on here? Thank you. Let's try this again. Thank you. I don't know why it dissolved that though, because... Well, whatever. Alright, so what I think I need to do then is... Do that, do that, do that. Save me walking, because I'm lazy. So, here's what I think we need to do. We need to go up here, put the place, place the portal on the angle panel so that we uh, don't walk over the dissolving area. Okay. Now we can go back through here. This would make sense, right? Okay, let's just grab a quick save there. And then fire the the, the wrong pole. It's, it's it's all good. We're still here. That's the main thing. Inputs, outputs, and all that sort of thing. Okay, so now I think we're going to want to do... What are we going to want to do? I don't think we need that anymore. Get rid of that, we get rid of that. The laser's got to be the laser cube's got to be recalled, right, to get that one. And I could The problem is, now, once I, um... Send that into there. Then I could refire on the floor. Alright, so I think this is what I'm going to need to do. Do that. Send the cube over there. Then we... Do that. Do that. 
Take the cube. Press the button. And then I can do this. Okay. Let's grab a save there, shall we? So... I now need to keep... I got two cubes, right? So I can put the cube back on the funnel. Get the laser. And take the other cube back. But, 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 but. see what the yellow field is for now. The yellow field is to stop me from rushing back over the dissolving area. Because if I do... Hmm. that intended. I mean, I can quite easily jump over that. what I would do now before I do that I need to put this on this this is why the ultimate fizzler is kind of disabled on this button. No, I don't think I've done anything wrong. Oh, crap. Mm, no, not biggie. No biggie. It didn't matter about jumping over there anyway, right? Okay, so it doesn't matter about jumping over that field because I've got to re sort. I've got to sort the portals out anyway. This is the only way back up. So, all right. So it really doesn't matter. So take this cube. Doesn't do it anyway. No way. I'm. That's probably why I could jump over it. So in an ideal world. I would like to do, just to save myself some time, of course. Something like that, but it doesn't work, so. It's too tucked under the catwalk too much. Alright, so we do that. Then we head back. All of that that I just restarted for was a complete not waste of time. I misunderstood. I think the dissolving pads are only active then when you have a button or something uh, sorry a button is on the a button a cube is on the yellow button that's what i'm trying to say all right so now 
we take this little kitty. Just speed things up a little bit. It's a long way round. Send off to there. Excellent. Now I do this. Yes, I forgot. I need to... Completely and utterly my fault. I need to shoot the portal and then go back down, don't I? Yep, that's what I need to do. No clip to try and make things faster, but then um, ultimately it's taking a lot longer. All right, save that state there. Almost home. Like a little push there when I fired that. that was a little bit weird. Let's just go down here. Then we're going to do something like this. Let's get the cube over to there. Then we're going to want to do that, right? No, before I did that, oh man. My problem is I'm rushing, I'm not really thinking things through before I before I act. So what I should have done instead, I've put this cube back over here. So yeah, I apologise for rushing through and making so many mistakes. It's totally on me. It's my bad. Alright, so from here, before I spawn the cube back... I actually need to get the laser, right? So I do... This. This. this have I been using the wrong cube though all this time did the laser cube really need to be on the thing because if I if I got the others set up right now, If I've got the other setup, get the cube. Ah, 
Um. See, if the cubes were the other way around, I could now go down, place that, I can't use the faith plate myself to pull the cube out of the funnel because the button is too far away from the, the button is too far away from the actual faith plate once you enable it. So the problem is, right? If I, I need to respawn a cube. So, I think I need to swap cubes. So, let's work on swapping the two cubes round. Right, so this one needs to go into the funnel. Okay, so I put a portal there. Here. All right, so we're going to here, and I can now at least get that cube into position. So let's put that one there. So cubes are swapped. Save that. So, hold on, if I now, I, th I still think I massively overcomplicate this. I have the laser, right? I have massively, massively, massively overcomplicated this. No, I haven't. Because...
I need a portal gun at this point. Because I need to put the laser cube here and angle the laser cube that way. I don't think swapping the cube has, has made a bit of difference here, actually, if I'm completely honest. So... I go get the laser. That's all well and good. Can't now go over here. Unless I do what I did before, which is recall the cube. Actually, hold on. There might be something here. I need to save at this point because I might choose to do it the other way around with the cubes. Alright, now I need to go and take this one. Forget the fact that I've got the, any portals. Take this one to here. Okay, so now I need to do this. I'm still not sure. I'm still not convince this actually helps my cause. I think it's just going to end up in exactly the same scenario I had before. La 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 la. Exactly the same. walk over there oh wait a second wait just a moment I thought I lost my portals as well oh my goodness I really don't understand these these dissolving areas properly it seems 
That makes loads more sense. Alright, so now I have a portal there. I fly up to here. Got a portal there. Run down to here. So now what I want to do from here. All I need to do is get that on there, do that. Oh my goodness. Yes, right, so now I do that. Now I go I have to do all this again here. Oh, but wait. Ah, I need to put that on there. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm almost there. Almost there. My right, clipholes. I'm gonna go around here, la la la. I have this cube here, la la la, and then I'm gonna put it on there. And go all the way around here, la 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 la, put a portal there, and I'm gonna fly up here. And we're gonna do that. We're gonna go back down. There's a lot of traveling in this map, around here, around here, around here, and back through this portal here. Then we're gonna do a fling from here. Over to here. Hit that like that. Press that button there. Fizzle this cube. Now we need to take this one back over to here. And now, which portal is my laser on? Black. Good. Alright, so then we come around here, put an orange portal here. We're all the way down here. And then, if we walk here. Pick up the cube. Yes! So, what I've taken away from this is those pads, those, um... Yeah, but I can't go through there, so I have to go this way. So those pads, these fizz dissolving areas, all they do is dissolve any cube that is touching. I mean, if I looked at the picture, it pretty much gives it away. But, um, yeah, I got totally confused about it. I thought by standing on that, my portals would get clear as well. I'm sure it, when I first stood on that pad earlier on in the level, my portals were fizzled as well. So that's what kind of threw me a little bit. I know I'm making excuses, but... Um, Okay, what I would say, if I'm completely honest about this, is there is too much repetition. I mean, it would be nicer if... It would be nicer if there was access from this room here... Or like easier access into there. I mean, obviously, I made a bit of a meal of, of things and, and struggled with the map, but I lost count of actually the amount of times I had to go from there to there and there to there and there to there. And I don't know. I just think there's a lot of travelling. Um, if you can like maybe come up with a way to shorten that somehow, um, and if you're worried about like people just taking cubes down to there, you could make this 
I don't know because if you made it a player only fizzler, you, you still got to do it. I don't know how you do that, but yeah, I just think the the whole thing is a little bit too big, and there is a little bit too much walking around. The puzzle itself was um, quite clever using that d dissolving. Uh, thing that I absolutely made a meal of. So, um, yeah, they're, they're my thoughts, guys. Thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any match to play, please leave them in the comments or head over to my Google form. I'll link to that's in the description. But until next time, I've been Ock. You've been awesome. See ya.